So our committee, it's young people aged from 14 to 24. And the aim of our committee is we basically meet every Monday and we sit down and we plan, uh, we plan all these kind of fundraisers and the events for the community and the aim of the project is to destigmatize and raise awareness on mental health so all the young people in our team are very passionate about mental health and we each champion and we work and we try and support other people in the planning group and as an organization we kind of realized that us young people also needed to take care of ourselves we also needed because a lot of us were also experiencing challenges and stuff uh, and it was also some of the reasons why we joined the youth committee in the first place some of the highlights of the program for me personally was bonding together with lots of people in our committee you know we knew each other but i think doing those exercises we came closer together Lots of people, you know, more friendships were grown together stronger. I think that really helped people to come out the shell more. I really enjoyed doing the team building games because I thought that it was really good for the committee to learn how to work as a team, um, get everyone involved and just have lots of fun while doing it. Some of the highlights from the programme for me was the team building activities, such as the Crystal Maze Challenge, as we learned to work together more. I loved our self-care session as we learned more about each other on like a personal level and it has helped us grow closer together as a team and as a family. They're like realizing now that not everybody has the same ability so they're taking like they're taking everyone's into consideration, making sure everyone's involved with everything that's going on and everyone has a say and a part to play, which I think is absolutely amazing. For me, it was more kind of seeing the committee come out of their shells a bit because we did have some young people there who um, kind of even going out uh, for a trip for that long, uh, going out for a residential is a challenge for them and that could cause a lot of anxiety but actually those people were the ones that were coming out of their shell more and being the ones that were talking and participating the most which was just really lovely to see. Uh, I believe that the programme has made a difference to the young people as it has taught us all about self-care and how important self-care is for our mental health. Um, it's shown us how to work together as a team and it's brought us closer together. It's, it's helped us know that we always have someone to turn to and that we're not alone. Everyone had to be involved somehow. You may not be the one doing it, but you had to be behind the scenes helping out as well. And that really shows like in a committee, you may not be the, the face of the operation, but you're in this behind the scenes helping out every step along the way and that really shows how it works. It's there's certain things that certain people are good at and certain things people are just not as strong as and it helps those individuals to come forward and then take charge and help the rest of the committee know what to do, help them come out of their shell a wee bit and try and learn how to do things. We normally are so busy helping other young people and other people within our community that we never stop to think of ourselves. So this <coughs> programme gave our young people and myself the chance to stop, take a break and think of, think of us for a change, like think of who we are, what we want, what what we do but also how we can support ourselves and how we can look after ourselves and what it means to take care of ourselves as well as the other people that we help support. There was teamwork, there was connections made, relationships were strengthened, um, we learned so much about each other and we also um, got to learn more about taking care of ourselves, learning to love ourselves, um, learning to value ourselves which is all really important because at the end of the day the stronger that we are um, individually, the resilience that we have will also strengthen the work that we do in the committee when it comes to organising events and fundraisers and all that other stuff. If we didn't have everyone we do, we could not run because we work as a team, not individually.